Welding. 1. Annealing of aluminum. Removes stresses caused by forming. 2. In gas tungsten arc, GTA welding, a stream of inert gas is used to prevent the formation of oxides in the puddle. 3. Welding over bronze head or solder joints is not permitted. 4. A welding torch backfire may be caused by a loose tip. 5. The oxyacetylene flame used for aluminum welding should be neutral and soft. 6. High pressure cylinders used to transport and store acetylene must contain acetone. 7. Why is it necessary to use flux in all silver soldering operations? To chemically clean the base metal of oxide film. 8. A very thin and pointed tip on a soldering copper is undesirable because it will cool too rapidly. 9. Which statement is true in regard to welding heat-treated magnesium? The welded section does not have the strength of the original metal. 10. In selecting a torch tip size to use in welding, the size of the tip opening determines the amount of heat applied to the work. 11. Oxides form very rapidly when alloys or metals are hot. It is important, therefore, when welding aluminum to use a flux. 12. Which statement best describes magnesium welding? Filler rod should be the same composition as base metal. 13. The oxyacetylene flame for silver soldering should be neutral. 14. Engine mount members should preferably be repaired by using a larger diameter tube with fish mouth and rosette welds. 15. Acetylene at a line pressure above 15 pounds per square inch is dangerously unstable. 16. Which statement concerning soldering is correct? Joints in electric wire to be soldered should be mechanically secure prior to soldering. 17. Why are aluminum plates 1 4 inch or more thick usually preheated before welding? Reduces internal stresses and assures more complete penetration. 18. What purpose does flux serve in welding aluminum? Minimizes or prevents oxidation. 19. How should a welding torch flame be adjusted to weld stainless steel? Slightly carburizing. 20. The most important consideration S when selecting welding rod is material compatibility. 21. In gas welding, the amount of heat applied to the material being welded is controlled by the size of the tip opening. 22. Oxygen and acetylene cylinders are made of steel. 23. Why should a carburizing flame be avoided when welding steel? It hardens the surface. 24. Filing or grinding a weld bead is considered to be a way to bring about strength reduction in joint. 25. The shielding gases generally used in the gas tungsten arc, GTA welding of aluminum consist of helium or argon, or a mixture of helium and argon. 26. Which of the following can normally be welded without adversely affecting strength? 2. SAE 4130 chrome molybdenum tubing. 27. A resurfaced soldering iron cannot be used effectively until after the working face has been tinned. 28. When a butt welded joint is visually inspected for penetration, the penetration should be 100% of the thickness of the base metal. 29. What method of repair is recommended for a steel tube long run dented at a cluster? Welded patch plate. 30. Edge notching is generally recommended in butt welding above a certain thickness of aluminum because it 
aids in getting full penetration of the metal and prevents local distortion. 31. Which statement concerning a welding process is true? The inert arc welding process uses an inert gas to protect the weld zone from the atmosphere. 32. If too much acetylene is used in the welding of stainless steel, the metal will absorb carbon and lose its resistance to corrosion. 33. Cylinders used to transport and store acetylene contain acetone. 34. Where should the flux be applied when oxyacetylene welding aluminum? Paint it on the surface to be welded and applied to the welding rod.